Oh, it is a two star. Look at that. Do you have a weak spot, mate? Oh my god. Again, look at the timing. Just look at the timing. I'm running out of stamina with this guy. Oh, no, 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 no. That was almost death right there. One, two, three, four, five. Yagloth fight. Oh my god. Greetings everyone, greetings fellow Vikings, <laughs> welcome back to a brand new episode of our Archer in a Hardcore Permadeath Valheim. Wow, this is the decisive episode, I guess. I've prepared a lot of things, I've changed my cloak, I've changed my helmet as you can see. But yeah, I'm gonna have the world settings on the screen, we're also gonna have the stats, some of you asked for the stats, so there they are, all the stats. <laughs> We've had a lot of a run here. We have raised the run skill to a lot of 72. That's insane. Also the jump at 60. So, uh, yeah, we're going. We're doing this. Special thanks to Kate for supporting the channel directly. Also special thanks to Russell. So, uh, it's on. <laughs> it's on. We're doing this. I still need to do some last minute preparations here. I also forgot the most important thing, these things, because without them I can't do anything. I only have two out of five. I hope that I'm going to find a base, let's just sleep on it, and first thing in the morning we're going to sail there. I hope I'm going to find a base or some towers around there, because if I don't, we're going to have a problem. But yeah, I think uh, I think it's fine. We may want to wait, wait out a raid in here. I'm not 100% sure that we're going to do that. I've just had a raid, so I've spent around five or six days, I, I can't remember, I think it was day 59. And this is what I've achieved, so I've changed the cape for one extra armor, which is amazing. <laughs> we have one extra... Do we have one extra armor? I don't know. I don't I don't believe so. Okay, it's a bit confusing for me. Yeah, I've also changed... Um, the what are they called? The forges, the smelters with blessed furnaces, so we can get this process. The black metal, not I can't do anything with it. It's really useless at this point for me, <laughs> so it's not like I'm using it. Uh, different things happen here. I've extended the base, so I did expand it to this side. We can grab the barley flour. Oh yeah, we can do pots and pans. Okay, so I'm carrying too much. We're gonna drop these and come for them. Oh, we can have the pots and pans, so we can have the upgrade. What's happening here, though? Oh, right! They attack the crops! Yeah, I had an event, and apparently, yeah, the monsters attack the crops. That's interesting! <laughs> okay, we that's, that's, that's good to know. We can have the bar in here. We're gonna need a lot of it though. I'm super tired. I'm recording this near the I mean near D. It's ten. It's nine. Nine PM. <laughs> Close to night time. Even it's dark outside. So Yeah, we're good to go at this point. We're good to sail. I had my forge. I have everything else. I have some um, some arrows loaded up onto the boat. We just need to do one more base before trying to attempt or attempting this. However, I don't have any... I don't have any... Uh, we might have to do some runs back and forth. Yeah, we might need to do that. I don't have any outpost there. So it pointed me toward the Black Forest. So if it's just on the edge or close to the ocean, that's totally doable. If not, we're going to have to build an entire outpost there just to be safe from raids. Because imagine having a raid before fighting the boss or <laughs> right after you spawn it. Is it possible? It never happened to me, but is it possible? To have a raid while you <laughs> fight a boss? That's that's strange. So yeah, it's, it seems like uh, for some people, we've died. We've actually died. So uh, we're playing with the ghost now. This is the archer's ghost. Even though 80% of you voted that we should continue with this. That we actually didn't die, but yeah. We're not going to go into that again. 
We're gonna finish this series one way or another, and I'm gonna try and play it again, way safer, so that we don't have discussions of this sort. Okay, so I need to start setting this way at this point, because I need to get on the other side of our outpost with the boat. Oh yes, I haven't showed you. This is what we loaded up into the boat. Okay. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna start sailing, and what's going on there in the horizon? <laughs> Those fish are floating. Floating fish. Okay, there's a troll. Hi. <laughs> I've just taken care of some trolls in the uh, melee run. So yeah, I'm gonna start sealing, and I will catch you. Or I will also I will catch you <laughs> when we get there, because this is gonna take me quite a while to get to the outpost on the other side. Okay, we're here. Eventually we made it up. <laughs> we made it here. Uh, that's not good. It's gonna get banged up on the shore. There's my little safe haven. My little safe haven. Ooh, it's gonna have a raid. It's, we're gonna have a raid. It's been so much time since we had a raid, so ooh, we're running out of wood for the fire. Uh, do I have any wood left in here? Oh, we do. Ooh, we do have. That's fine. Okay, so we are gonna sleep on it. It's it's foggy outside and I can't see anything. I can't even see where I'm going. So obviously we're not gonna go. We're just gonna sleep on it. And first thing in the morning we're gonna go there. Problem is, like I said, I don't know what's up there, what's going on there. The only thing I know is that I've spotted a black forest towards that direction. So I'm looking at my map right now. And um, things aren't looking that great because on my map... Okay, so on my map right now... In that direction I can only see a uh, black forest. That's what I saw last time, so maybe I should have spent some time in the base so that we don't get raided. Hold on. Just one second, let's see. Will a raid start at any point here? Because we we had no raid, like I said, for a while. Also, another thing, another cool thing, I have uh, crafted the padded helmet for some extra armor. I think it's for extra armor. I, well, I'll take it <laughs> at this point. I'm gonna take every single bit of armor that we can get our hands on. Yeah, okay, so no raid, we'll just wing it. Okay, no raid. I'm so gonna regret this. Okay, the ship is not banged up on the shore like I expected. So in theory, that's, uh, you can see the outline of the next island is like a small continent or a rather large one, I don't know, it seems to be stretching for quite a while. As you can see, those are pines in the distance, so that's Black Forest, that's what I've spotted from the shore. So we'll go there, we'll go to the Black Forest. Actually, let's roam around the Black Forest a bit. Let's see if we can spot some patch of planes. Usually planes, uh, you're gonna have planes, or the planes by them will uh, stretch near the water, somewhere near the water. Uh, this is not good, I can't see anything. Oh, is, if it's gonna be... Yeah, it's gonna be raining. I guess it's gonna be raining here. That's a no-go for me. So let's just explore a bit here first, because I don't know what's waiting for me on the other side. So let's go that way. It looks like Black Forest. This way it looks like Black Forest. Everywhere <laughs> it's just Black Forest. Yeah, I don't think we're that lucky to have planes. Although... That kind of looks like a weird boulder. It doesn't look like a Black Forest boulder. Or I may be wrong. <laughs> Let's just see. We're just gonna go smoothly around this edge. And if everything's good, we're gonna find a cute... Sp no, that's planes. Yep, that's planes. You can see by the color. Okay, so we have planes. Let's just look around. Maybe we can find a base around here somewhere. I would uh, give anything to have a small base near the water, which we can raid. And that looks like a tower. 
which is good. It's actually super good, uh, but sometimes those towers don't always... Uh, you, can you cannot always find uh, the totems in the tower. And, of course, it's going to be... Ooh, that's some fire. I can see some fire there. Wow, look at that. We actually made it. So, uh, what do we do here? If we approach it from here, what do I do? This is rather risky and dangerous. I'm going to have a small pillar right there. Also, let's equip this. Oh my god, my heart starts to pound again. My heart starts pounding again. I don't know if this is wise or not. But we kind of need to do this one way or another. Hold on a second. I need to grab these items. I also need to be super quiet, just in case. Okay, we got it. So we're gonna have a uh, one, two, three, five. Whew. What's that? <laughs> Is that a lux burning? I think that may be a lux burning. Okay, how did that happen? Oh my goodness, by the coloring. How many berserkers? One, two, three, four, five. Wow, I never, I've never seen a camp with five berserkers. How on earth am I going to do this? Ooh, there's the altar. Oh my god, I've never spotted it. Jesus, I was looking at the berserkers. Okay, this is good. It's near the Black Forest. That means we can maybe shoot it from the Black Forest. We can avoid some dangerous raids. And I might have done something silly here. No, wait. Also, that looks like kind of tiny fortress right there. How many fuelings are in there? Can I raise this a bit more? Okay, now that we have this little safe haven here, we're gonna have a raid soon. That's something I'm 100% sure about. <laughs> so uh, I just need to grab me some more stone before that happens. So it's gonna be very, very careful and slow progression here. I'm actually gonna create another pillar or wormhole or call it whatever you want. So we have 40, I just need one more, one more, come on. Okay, we're good. There's bound to be an event very, very soon. Yes. Bam, there we go. I don't need, for, I don't care for the black metal at this point. Now where do I want this? Who spotted me? <laughs> Did someone spot me? Okay, I'm gonna need one right there, and it's it's gonna I have to make it taller. So this won't do. And I will need more arrows. Um Should we take this camp first? That's my question. Maybe we should take this tower first. Oh my god, this is late at night and I'm doing this. Well if I die I die, so Anyway, most of you wanted to see me gone. That's a totem, which is good. That means it's a double totem for us. And there's another feeling right here on top of this. Well, the only thing I'm going to grab from here is the, <laughs> the actual needles. Oh, I should have had some needle arrows with me. Oh, come on. That was... I forgot about those. Really? Oh, come on. I totally forgot about those. 
I can also shoot them from here. Problem is, I'm not 100% safe in here. Also forgot my ooze bombs again, which is amazing. Oh, that looks so, so, so bad. That looks legitimately super bad. Can I grab one without aggroing everything? Oh my god. No. He just moved. Oh, that looks like a two-star. Okay, somehow I managed to aggro him. Okay, let's quickly move back to this bow. Oh, it is a two-star. Look at that. Do you have a weak spot, mate? Oh, my God. Look at the damage output. And I'm barely scraping off his HP. How am I going to do this with a melee? <laughs> How am I going to do this with a melee champion? Or on the melee playthrough? Oh, my God. It's going to take me ages. So we can do that, we can definitely, there are locks there too, this is bonker, this is insanity right here. How am I even going to be able to do this? Wow, um, super focused right here, because so many things can go wrong. Also, I hate all this black metal. Oh, they dropped, they dropped totems? I didn't know that. Hey, you. Okay, apparently they dropped totems. We are at four, which means we have enough by picking these up. Hold on. There. We've got enough. We've got it covered. Um, however, I don't feel 100% safe in this tower, at least not from the little shaman attacks. So I'm just gonna make a run for it back here to safety. I just feel a raid coming. I don't want to do this um, with a raid on the way, on its way. I need another structure like this one right there. I'm just scared to go right there. And I need to make it taller. Maybe that's a bit too close. It's a bit too close for my comfort. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna need it here. Again, look at the timing. Just look at the timing. I've slapped down a workbench. Oh, my heart is pounding. Those are aggroed now and... Oh, no, that's not good. Or is, is it good? No, they're just gonna be obliterated. So the event starts here. Are they gonna be aggroed though on me? Because of the wolves. Oh, please don't get me aggroed. If those guys are coming for me, I'm in a lot of trouble. Are they coming for me? Please don't. They're super far away, they shouldn't be coming for me. Ooh, this is not a good idea. I'm kind of stuck. Again. I slap the workbench and the event starts. <laughs> I was so sure about this. So the only way you can do this is if you do it like this. You have a pillar, you have a wormhole there, you have a wormhole, wormhole here. Those stones are not working. I've tried, I've tested the theory that there the wolves can just climb through there. So they can go through there all the way up to you. The developers uh, lowered the slopes on the rocks so they can get to you super easily. Woo, okay, so this event is actually well timed because we can actually tackle the entire base without uh, worrying ourselves too much about another event happening really soon. I may not be able to do this in one episode. There are so many dangers between me and that altar. <laughs> 
because the the fight itself is going to be super easy for me at least but uh you're not going anywhere guys oh my god where am i shooting why was i shooting there <sighs> okay just want to get rid of your loot i know this is counterproductive and not a good idea what is happening? Okay, I can I'm gonna need it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, let's make it to eight. Cause this is gonna make me feel way safer. Okay. We're out, of st we're out of stone. I can take down the workbench. Where's my workbench? We can tear that down. Just need to grab some more stone. Some more rocks. There are some rocks around here. Oh, there's one right here. I'm not talking too much because this can go south really fast and really bad. I also need to grab the rocks, and they're kind of in the way. So I do need to place down, just slap down one more uh, pillar. Like right here. Okay, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Now I need to flatten them a bit, just a tiny bit. So I can see it on them. And if anything goes bad, we're just gonna jump inside. Maybe it will be clever on my behalf. Where's the rest of the wood that I've thrown? To have some ladders here. So I can quickly access this in case I fall or something goes terribly bad. So much preparation, I don't know if we're going to be able to do this in one episode. Because this is this is really risky at this point. Uh, I'm going to need, actually, I'm going to need the rocks to have the arrested buff. I'm going to need to go back to the ship. See, on these rocks, they can climb through there. They can easily climb through here. So they just go like this. And they're here. They lowered the slope, so you're no longer safe on these. But I'm sure most of you know this, so uh, that's not a surprise. I'm just gonna need these, these, and a ton of these, unfortunately. I'm gonna need a ton of these. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're just, I'm just gonna need the rested buff. I need you to go away. Don't have time for you right now. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna tackle that base. That's a huge base. Like, it's the <laughs> it's the largest base I've ever, ever seen. Um, also, it's kind of close to sunset. So we're gonna wait for the rest of the buff and we're gonna come here the next day. I think that's the wisest thing to do at this point. So we don't risk it. We do have all the totems. We do have all the totems. We're good. We're good on that aspect, at least. So yeah, I'm going to wait for the rest of the buff. We're just going to go back to our outpost. We're going to sleep the night there. We're going to spend the night in there. Yeah, that was amazing. So I've lost all my HP there. Oh, no, wait. Hold on. Jump in the boat. There we go. In the boat. So yeah, back to our outpost. Outpost. And we're going to come here in the morning. That looks far too dangerous for my comfort. Without Now the, the night is coming as well. So that's a no for me. Oh wait, this is not my base. We've came from there. Wow, this is super convenient, honestly. The way the planes touch the water and you can see the altar from the shore. That's super convenient. 
We might have to do something with the Black Forest there, just to be super safe. We might try to shoot him from the Black Forest. Just because I'm I'm a coward and I'm scared of raids now. Like, super scared of raids. But it was my bad. They actually changed it before... Um, I think a year or two years ago. You would have had... Um, the wolves events, you, you are being hunted event after you defeated the mother. Now you're, you're having that after you defeat the bone mass, which is far more difficult, so they kind of increased the difficulty of the game with that. And given the world setting, settings that we're running on, yeah, that's not a... <laughs> that was not good, so even, even if you think that we've died or we've, we haven't died, so I'm still gonna try and finish this. I only take in the death when it's actually me being dead and the screen says you died. So uh, that's when I actually believe that I'm dead. And that's when I agree that I'm dead. But yeah, if, uh, if for some reason most of you think that I shouldn't continue this series, well, tough luck, I feel sorry for you. That means you're uh, part of those 20% that actually believe in unison that I shouldn't have continued the series but uh, we're, we're just gonna see where we can pull this through and uh, when I die trust me when I die we're gonna see it we're gonna see it as gonna be super super duper obvious it's gonna be a large message on the screen and a dead body on the floor in the dirt okay new day Whew. We can pull this, we can get this, we can do this. One way or another, come on. <laughs> oh, this is a bad idea. This is such a bad idea. I don't know how I'm going to be able to tackle that. Uh, what is this guy doing here? I don't know how I'm going to be able to tackle the entire base. I know for a fact I don't have enough arrows. Ugh, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna skip this, and uh, I'll be back with you once I uh, get back to the little uh, wormhole there. And we're back. This wasn't that much of a long trip, but it takes a while to uh, get the boat in reverse here. So. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly run for it. Hope, hopefully, we're not gonna have another event. That's gonna be super, super weird. Okay. I've turned down the SSAO so I can see better what's happening here. We are still a bit far away from all that, uh, from their camp. However, I don't wanna get any closer unless it's super necessary. So I wanna go for that one. Let's see. So I managed to aggro one. We're just gonna take them one by one, because otherwise it's impossible for me to do this. <laughs> okay, that was... That shouldn't have happened. I'm just trying to focus now. Come on, why aren't you dead? Oh, it's, it's it's why is it raining right now? Okay, so I can't stand there. I can stand here though. Don't need those right now. I can't spot them right now, and it's a bit of a problem since I can't spot them. Luckily with the other bow, I can only grab them one by one, so I don't aggro the entire camp. Okay, this one's goner. Yeah, let's just use the pickaxe. Okay, that's good. We got him. Oh no, wait. What am I doing? The frost arrow is really overpowered because you can slow them down with it. Where's the other? Okay, so you're you're a thrower. Where are you at? Yeah. 
I'm looking around because I heard some. I'm, I'm gonna be super quiet. Or as quiet as I can be. I might have aggroed too many. That's the shaman coming as well. Oh my god. Well, that was a sneak shot for quite some damage. Look at his HP. The two star was a problem, but this one is fine. Okay, that was the shaman. Oh, I wish I can see them better. There's a huge pile of them. <laughs> just there in the middle of it. Let's just save here. There's a very... There you go, another event. Oh, I can actually... Um, we can actually aggro more of them. Oh no, wait. Let's just wait for the event. Of course I'm being hunted. Imagine being on foot. Yeah, so I don't know if... <laughs> I don't know if this is possible with the... I or maybe it is, I don't know. With the melee, on the melee challenge. I do have some strategies for this event. Oh, look at them, they're all shielded. I can't do anything. That shaman is a menace. If that shaman gets me, I'm super, super duper dead. Even with the fire resistance. That shaman deals a ton of damage. This is unreal how much damage the shaman does. Okay, I'll be back with you when this is over, because this is weird, this is just staying here. And it's done. That's one, that's another one, where is your friend? How are the arrows going through you? Good, I'm wasting arrows at this point. Okay. <laughs> well, let's see what I can do next. The thing is, I can't really see that well in there. And now, they're kind of close to each other. The only reason why I'm tilting the camera like this is because I have that weird screen with curved edges. Oh my god, what have I got myself into? I need to take care of one at least before the other one falls onto me. Oh my god, this guy is gonna delete me. Unfortunately, he's not able to actually do anything. This is the reason why I raised the level of this. Just for this guy. So we had a two star, and now it's a one star. OMG. I'm running out of stamina with this guy. Oh! No, 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 no. That was almost death right there. Oh my god. We're gonna wait him out. I'm not gonna get out there with this guy. I'm not gonna go out there with this guy in my tail. Ooh. I hate the shaman. He deals insane damage. And this game has no means to protect yourself from... Uh, Mag any magical damage. As am I safe? I don't know. Oh come on, please. Where is he? I can't see him. Come on, come on, come on. That was super, super dangerous and super, super dumb on my behalf. Let's attempt to grab one more. This has to be the largest camp. And it's right there in my way. I fear that if I'm going to fight Yagoth, all the, the entire camp is going to come on me. It's going to descend upon me. Okay, 
Okay, we're good. How many shamans are in there as well? There might be a lot of shamans. Okay, one, one. There we go. Come on, big boy. Come on, big boy. Come on. Why do you move so weirdly? How can I hit you if you move like that? Oh my god. What's wrong with this guy? This is silly. This is one of those bad ideas. Oh, I'm super scared. This is no longer fun. This is no longer the fun Valheim experience. This is the... You're gonna die really soon if you don't... Uh, That was the landed shot. If you're not paying attention, that is. I might regret this shot. It's fun that they see the arrow and they know which way they, uh, the arrow is coming from and they're just gonna charge that way. Not this guy, he's gonna decide to move sideways for some reason. Okay, we got him. Well, let's just land a huge arrow right there in the middle of them. If it's a shaman coming, I can deal with him. Those guys are super far away. I think they're way out of radius. Got him. Come on. They stop midway. <laughs> They start moving into one direction that they stop. Also, there are wolves about. Why are there wolves about? From the event, I guess. Leftovers. <laughs> um. How do I do this? I don't have any workbench with me. I need to repair my stairs. Oh, my friend, I don't have time for you right now. Eh, let me, let me buy, let me buy. Okay. Whew. Every time I get down from here, I feel like I'm in danger. Okay, what else? What else is in there? What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? I may need another structure like this one a bit closer there. That's just gonna make me put me even in more danger. I somehow need to aggro the locks. I need to get rid of these guys as well. They're gonna eat a whole What am I shooting you with frost arrows though? Thought you were resistant to frost. Okay, at least now we have some sun, and I can spot them way easier. Uh, where is that guy going? Sorry guys, I'm just focusing here, I'm just... I'm everywhere. So they run around, they go near you, they just move away, and that's another shaman, that's another shaman right there. This has to be the largest fueling camp I've ever seen in the entire... <laughs> in, in four years of Valheim. Okay, got one. So the locks, now that are aggroed, are just gonna go... Through the forest and everywhere is gonna go close to sundown. 
This took me another 20 minutes? You want to tell me that this took me another 20 minutes? Oh my god. How am I even going to be able to reach Diaglas' altar? Oh, I'm not going to wait for this. Let's just finish him off. And if it just wants to be a new uh, problem. If it decides to be a problem. <laughs> actually, I shot the other guy. I shot the Berserker. Oh my god, this would take me years. If I'm gonna play this on the melee, this is gonna take me years. Literally years. Oh, there's the Shaman. Oh, come on. Where are you? Can't spot him. Okay, there's one more fueling, and I do need to get another one of these structures right there. Then I'm gonna have the village, but that still won't keep me safe. Um. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I do want to go to that village and loot all the goodies. We're running out of time, so I need to go back to the base. My bow is running out of durability. I didn't know that this is going to be the uh, extent of this episode. I'll be back with you when I get to the outpost. Okay, I made it. I had no wind, so this took me forever. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, though. I just want to get back to the safety of my little outpost. Also, I'm running through my Draugr Fangbow durability like crazy. Now, that base was not necessary to take on. I don't believe it was 100% necessary to take on, but uh, I feel a lot safer if that base is not there. When I start fighting, where I fight Yagloth, because if those guys aggro on me by any mistake or by any chance, um, I may be in a lot of trouble. Okay, I do need to grab some more arrows. 168 days. It is possible that I uh, do this, that I finish the base right now. Wait, I need some rocks. There are some rocks in. There were some rocks in here. There we go. So we got these, we got tan. Yeah, let's get a lot of it. Let's just get a... Let's just go like this for now. So I can quickly build a workbench and raise another one of those uh, pillars or wormholes or <laughs> call it whatever you want. To keep us safe in there. I don't know what I'm going to do about the Mistlands. I am super duper worried and scared about the Mistlands. Again, we're going to sail with no wind. That's amazing. Yeah, I'll see you in a second. I don't know what's happening with the weather. Now it's raining, now it's sunny. <laughs> it's, it's a bit weird. I'm going to need more arrows. Let's drop these in here. Okay, watch me being hunted again. As soon as I snap the next workbench. How are you not... Oh, you're a one star. How are you not gone? Now this will be the last pillar here. The ultimate pillar. This is bad. Can I please get you? Thank you. One, two, three. There we go. Make you sing. <laughs> I love that sound. You're gone. Okay, um... Where do I want this? I want this to go here. Okay, all the way up to seven. And one more. Come on. We can do this. I'm out of rocks. 
Why, please? Oh, God. Ooh, this is dangerous. I'm super... What am I doing? I'm sliding. I'm super silent because I don't want to do anything. Oh my god, what am I doing? It's fog again. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. This game. This game. <laughs> wow, this game is just insane. So where do I place these? Okay, we got him. That's nice. It's cozy. I like it. Um, look at that. That's called progress, right? Because you can see what's happening. You can totally... Luckily, I can spot them right on my top right hand of the screen. Almost. <laughs> oh my god! Got him. So, yeah. Just when I was trying and hoping that this is gonna be a fun experience. They're kinda close to the altar, so that's the only reason why I'm taking it, like I said. You may want, you may say, oh, that's not really necessary. True. That may not be super 100% necessary. But however... They're kind of too close for my comfort, like I said. Now I have to look at my... Uh, on the left, on the right side of my screen. And again, I'm using... What was... What am I thinking? Got him. Okay. We're gonna have another event. Uh, can I land a shot on you? I can't spot him. So I'm shooting randomly at now, which is really dangerous, but luckily there aren't that many left in there. Missing so many arrows though. It's good because we have a ton. I'm gonna need a ton for Yaglith too, so... Uh, do I go in there? Do I wait in here? Um, <laughs> let's go in there. Let's get in here for a second. I don't know what's happening in here. I don't know how many are left, and or if if there's a shaman here. Oh my god! Um, follow me this way, please. <laughs> we okay. Thought that was a one star. Right? That would have been a uh, a problem to say the least. Where is your friend? There was... What was that? Oh, there you are. They're so green, you c I can't... I keep mistaking them for uh, bushes. I'm just gonna wait for you to stop running. So I don't waste a ton of arrows on you. Okay, you should have been gone like you are. Okay, you are gone. Uh... I just want to clear this camp. I don't want your loot. I don't want anything from here. I may just take the flax from here. Look at the totems. Look how many totems they have. So, no room in inventory. Oh my god, I thought I was being hunted or something. I just want to get this and get, get out of here. Get out of here. I really need this for... Uh... Ah! <laughs> I get spooked there for a second. They're everywhere. They're like a plague. Can't shake them off. But these guys aren't the real problem. The real problem or the real menace lies... Um... With the raids and with the... Oh, you missed me, friend. I'm just gonna stay here. Look at that. <laughs> we're getting everything. We're getting the mosquitoes. We're getting uh, 
Oh my god, we're getting our hands on nothing. And I don't care about the loot. Don't tell me there's a shaman in there. Looks like there's nothing in there. There's someone stuck upstairs. That's it. That was the last one. Please tell me that was the last one. Okay. Oh, okay. So what I'm gonna do at this point... I'm kind of far away, uh, too far away from my own comfort from with <laughs> from my uh, wormholes. Let me just get back. There's stuff everywhere. I hate this. There's garbage everywhere. I don't want this loot. Okay, so um, no matter what, I'm gonna start working on the arena for the Yaglith, and I'm gonna have a small wormhole in the Black Forest. So that's where we're headed right now. Let's let me just go there, and we're just gonna come for the loot in the boat. Because in here, even if we're gonna get raided, it's not gonna be the hunt. Like we're not gonna have the hunt in here. At least I know that for a fact. I really don't want these uh, monsters around. I just look for a safe spot. Just looking for a safe spot. There is no safe spot around here. Great. This looks like a good uh, position. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna start working on the arena and I'll catch you all when the arena is ready. Okay, and we're back. <laughs> a few days have passed. I'm super tired. Oh, hey fellas. Uh, these guys came out of nowhere. So uh, let me show you what I've been working on. So this is where we're gonna shoot him from. I prepared this spot with a safe hole in there in case something goes bad. Got all the forges here for repairing items and everything. Got my dumping. I'm just gonna dump some items in there. Um, uh, yeah, another safe hole there. I needed one when I traveled from uh, this place to that one. So I've surrounded this entire his entire arena with a uh, with a wall. Now fingers crossed that everything goes. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Yeah, this is the, I don't know, fourth event that we're going to get. Oh, it's a good thing that we got the event right now. I'll be back with you once the event is um, is over. So I'm just going to wait it out here. Okay. I don't know what happened to the event. I've had no troll around here. This is weird. It's weird that I don't like it. Where are the trolls at? Okay, so let's just get... Oh, there they are! <laughs> They're having fun on the planes. Unfortunately, I need to take them out. Because uh, they can be a problem. Also, they fought something there. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. Yagloth fight. Oh my god. Come on, buddy. Run for it. Run for it. Yagloth Twisted Soul has been summoned. Where? Oh, he's right there. Root Harnesk, <laughs> just for you, friend. Now you're gonna come for me, come on. This is the only downside. The another downside is that I can't really spot him from here. Oh yeah, there I spot him. I see his head. Okay, so this is gonna be a ton of arrows into his head. So I'll be back with you <laughs> once we're done shooting. I think it works. The arena thingy works. We can trap him in his own arena there. So yeah, I'll be back when I finish shooting all these arrows.
Okay, he's almost done. I can't believe we've achieved this. Oh, my palms were so sweaty up until this point. Yagla's soul has been defeated. Good riddance! Look at that explosion. Yummy, yummy explosion. Oh my goodness. Let's just repair. I'm gonna leave these things here. We're just gonna take up our arrows. On um, items. Yes, I need this. Uh, these can remain here. I'm just gonna wait out. Let's get the rested buff, just in case. I can't believe that this happened. I cannot believe that we've achieved this. Oh my god, if I die in the Mistlands, I'm super happy. Like, I'm past Yagloth at this point. <laughs> Anything can happen. We can die at any point. So we're gonna have Seekers now coming our way. Let's hope that we can get home before Seekers are gonna start uh, chewing on our butts. Actually, I should have this in case there are any death skeetos around. Let's just go and collect his... Uh, I don't know what they are... Um, Tears? No, they're not tears. Hold on, let's get the SSEO back. So we have some shadow in here. So I don't burn your eyes. But I needed to have the SSEO down so I can actually spot him. Oh, Torn Spirit. Yeah, we need the Wisp Fountain. Oh my goodness, we're gonna need a ton of Wisp Fountains. Wait, do I only have three? What happened here? Weren't they supposed to be five? Okay, I'll take them, I guess. I should be happy as it is. I should be happy as it is. Okay. I'm gonna quickly run for the boat. I don't care about anything. We're gonna leave everything here. I just wanna go and place this trophy. So I'm gonna take you back to the main island. We need to place this trophy and celebrate. And I'm gonna go back to the base and I'm gonna call it a day. So I'll see you when I get back to the actual main island, so we can actually place this trophy. I finally made it. <laughs> this took me around 40 minutes to get here. So... <laughs> wow, I forgot how far away this was, actually. Can I make it there now without any raids? Because we didn't have a raid in a lot of time. Can I please get here? I don't want to build any campfire or anything. I'm just gonna run for it in short steps. Do I have it with me? Okay, I have it with me. We can get totally raided here. Something I don't want to happen right now. <laughs> oh my goodness. I've missed this spot. I've missed, I've actually missed this spot. Look at this. Where's the hook? Come on, come on, we're wasting time here. I don't want to read this. Oh my god, come on. Really? Stop. <laughs> there we go. Yes! <laughs> we got Yaglith. That's insane. Okay, I've seen enough. Let's just run for it. <laughs> I don't want to spend any second here we we don't have the rested buff we may get raided really fast so uh please 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 let me get to the boat let me get back to the base so we can wrap up this episode right there i'm running i'm running i'm running this is super dangerous i have no means of safety here Whee! <laughs> okay and start battling so uh I'm gonna go to that island around it. We're gonna go back to the Elder, where, is, where the base is. And I'll catch you all there, where, where we are gonna end this episode. I'm actually insane. We made it back. <laughs> we made it back home. This feels so good. Almost. <laughs> the ship's kind of banged up. Uh, can we not get raided? I also killed two serpents. Yeah, we can't carry that right now. We can carry everything else but the meat. So let's quickly run for it. I have no rested buff. This is silly. I'm just going to look for trolls because we had a two star troll here. Wow, that was quite a journey. 
That was quite a journey, friends. Now, everything would be perfect if I don't get, get raided up until I get back to the base. I also don't want the raids to take out my crops. But we're gonna test it. We're gonna see if they actually do take out the crops. We Oh my goodness. We've made it back home. I think I'm gonna cry. Let's cry. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's... That's beyond surreal. Oh, look at this bed. Look at the furniture. Look at the safety. <laughs> that was one crazy adventure in the plains. I don't want to... Oh, it's a storm going outside. I don't want to ever do that again. Maybe we will do a quick run. If I'm able to kill all the bosses... We're gonna do a quick run for all the other bosses, so we're gonna kill all the bosses again. But I don't know if we're ever if we are ever gonna get there. So that was it for me. Crazy, crazy episode. We did it, we killed Yagleth. Queen is waiting somewhere. We'll see where. I don't know exactly. And uh, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for your support. And I'll catch you in our next adventure. Bye bye.